Bring that light in a little bit. There we go. Bring the light in for the light skin. You know? Let's get into the video, man. Yo, what's up with the sneakerheads? Now, nah, sneakerheads, everything in between. It's your boy, Trey D, Trey D's Kicks. And you know what? I know I'm a little late on this video because I said I was going to do a comparison video a little while back, but better late than never is what I always say. Pine Greens. Pine Green 2.0. Reverse Pine Greens. Pine Green 1.0. Alright man, so y'all already know I picked the Pine Green, the Reverse Pine Green, the Pine Green 2.0s, hell, the Black and Green Pine Greens. I picked these joints up a couple of weeks ago and man, I really like them. I know a lot of people were like, I don't really like these, but the quality on here, man, this, 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 this toe box right here. Oh, where's my, oh, okay. Got my shoe tree wasn't in there. I was like, I ain't worn these, but you know what I'm saying? I didn't know where my shoe tree was at. Anyway, man, I picked these joints up a couple of weeks ago, and so I wanted to do a comparison video, and both of these are size 11. Hold on, I gotta turn my box around. Wait a second. Both of these are size 11, so these will be apples to apples. Pine Green 2.0. Original Pine Green joints, and these are the Pine Green 1.0. I don't need, I don't even know what you want to call them, man. But these are the original Pine Green, and man, these things are clean too. These are still DS as well as these. And so y'all know, it's 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 way too early to wear these shoes, man. You know what I'm saying? I, don't, I can't even remember when these came out, but I think, I mean, it was 2019. Everybody's wearing them. You know what I'm saying? And so I just, I don't want to wear them while everybody else is wearing them. So that's why I keep a lot of my shoes DS until like a couple of years. Generally what happens when I get a pair of shoes is they go in a plastic bag. So whether they're icy soles or not, I just go ahead and put them in a plastic bag, man. That's just me. You don't have to do that, but your boy does it. But I digress. Anyway, man, here you go. You got both of these joints in hand right here, man. And like I said, the quality on this one is really good, but the quality on this one is really good as well. Y'all have to let me know in the comment section if you have both pair, which one you think is better, which one will you rock before the other if you haven't rocked them yet. For the clear differences, let's go here. Of course, you have white panels here and then black panels here. That's that's off top, man. But you still got the white midsole and they're both white. Neither one are like the sale color, but they're both white midsoles. And so here on the original pine green, you have the black swoosh and here you have the green swoosh. So those are major differences, of course, that you see between the two. And then going towards the tongue, of course, you have a green tag here with Nike Air written in white. And then you have the black tag, which is done in leather, and the Nike Air is written in red. Both got nylon tongue, so that's not a big difference. Both came with black laces, as you can see. But another major difference is the reverse pine greens or the pine green 2.0, they actually came with a set of red laces, while this one actually came with a set of green laces. Both are done the same way though, just so you know. Now, another major difference, the Air Jordan Wings logo here is like the normal Air Jordan ones, but on this one, you have the raised Air Jordan logo. And I like that, man. I like that touch right there. It's just something different than your normal that you normally get. So this one and then this one. Now for the not so subtle changes on these joints right here, man, you got the quality of the leather on the back panel. Now, I don't know if y'all can see that. Y'all should be able to see that. You got the tumbled leather on the heel and you have the smooth leather on the 1.0. So this is the 2.0, and then this is the 1.0 right here. And if you could not tell, of course you have your green and your black right here with your swoosh. But this one looks a little bit thicker. 
So you got your black and your white, but that looks a little bit thicker, if y'all can tell. And so these are the collars. Like I said, both of these are size 11. So you can see the differences in the back of the shoe right there. Y'all see that? And then, of course, you have pine green outsole. And there's nothing different about this right here. Same thing. Nothing really changed, man. This is just the bottom of the shoe. Uh, you still got the Nike right here and then the Nike right there. So those are the main differences. The swoosh right here is smooth leather. Smooth leather while the swoosh here is done in tumbled. And the panels, the black panels are a little bit more tumbled than what I would think these are, these white panels right here. It's still tumbled, but it's not as tumbled. Going to the toe box again, you got a little bit more tumbled leather on the 2.0s, at least mine did. Y'all can see that tumbled leather right there. And then it is tumbled leather right here, but it's just not as pronounced as what the 2.0s are. Uh, but your leather, black leather, like I said, is tumbled here. Y'all can see that tumbled leather. And then on the original, it's a little bit more smooth. Y'all see that? And I know y'all should be able to see this right off top. This is a little bit more glossy finish on the black. Y'all see that? A little bit more glossy finish on that black right there and that toe than this right here. This has that matte finish. Got that matte finish on there. But those are the main differences, man. I just wanted to do a comparison video on these joints, man. I actually like both of these. Like I said, if you don't already know, man, besides red, green is my next favorite color. And so these joints are perfect. They did, the Jordan did this right, man. They, they doing this for St. Patrick's Day. I mean, this is the perfect timing, you know what I'm saying? So they brought these joints out for St. Patrick's Day. You definitely have to wear these joints if you're going out on St. Patrick's Day. I'm not going out on St. Patrick's Day. The corona is out there. Be careful. I'm not going out anywhere. I'm staying inside. Got my hand sanitizer though. Get you some hand sanitizer. I like both of them. I can't decide which one is my favorite. I know I've been kind of leaning towards this one. I do like that matte finish. I can't lie. I like that matte finish that's on these joints right here. Um, but these, these pop. These pop a little bit more to me just because of that white. This white brings it out a lot more. But I do like this matte finish and I like that tumbled leather. Now, just because a shoe has a lot of tumbled leather doesn't mean it's better quality or anything like that. But this one is soft. This one's, this one's pretty soft too. Yeah, actually they're both pretty soft. I don't know if y'all can tell, I don't think the camera's picking it up, but this one actually seems just a tad bit darker. Seems just a tad bit darker, man. I don't know if y'all can tell that, but it's, it's a tad bit darker. This green, just letting y'all know. Anyway, man, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below. Did you pick up both of these joints or did you just pick up the one? Yo, I definitely appreciate everybody who has been sticking with your boy, man. Whether you subscribe like day one or if you just subscribed two minutes ago, man. I definitely appreciate that, man. But my day ones, man, I really appreciate y'all, man. Um, yo, if you are not already subscribed to the channel, man, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy. Hit that thumbs up if you like what you see. Leave comments in the comment section. Your boy is always in the comment section, even though it might take me a little while to get to your comment, man. But I am always in the comment section, you know what I'm saying? Hit that notifications bell if you just do not get notified every time I drop a video. Hit that notifications bell for your boy, man. Your boy's about to get out of here, man. I got some other stuff I need to take care of, man. And I got this video running in the back. I don't know what to put in the background while I'm... I'm just trying to... Your boy's trying to make it work for right now. You know what I'm saying, man? Your boy's about to get out.